Hello dear ones, welcome back to my channel. My name is Kestrel, otherwise known as Kestrel the Nature Witch, and today I'm gonna share with you about my experience in a month-long witchcraft course. So before we kind of get really into the like meat and potatoes of the video, there's something I kind of want to mention here real quick, and that is if you are a intermediate to advanced practitioner watching this video, I'm going to challenge you not to click off and to watch the whole thing. Because while, yes, the witchcraft course I'm about to talk about is technically for beginners, that doesn't mean it's not valuable for you. I say that because this is the only witchcraft course of its kind I have ever taken. I've been practicing for several years now. Wow. Yeah, it's been a while. Oh, that's... Okay, we're just gonna have a little quick flashback there. Anyway, <laughs> I've been practicing for quite some time, um, and I've taken a lot of courses, I've done a lot of research, read a lot of books, watched all kinds of YouTube videos, all of that stuff, and this course taught me a ton of new stuff. I learned a lot from this as a what would be considered an intermediate to advanced practitioner. The name of this course is Living Witchcraft and it was created by Sanre of the Order of Chaos. Sanre has been practicing for a very long time, uh, much longer than I have been practicing, and so has a ton of experience, a ton of knowledge, and he's honestly one of the most patient teachers I've ever fucking met in my life. So if you've watched a few of my videos, you're probably aware that I'm someone who really likes research, and I really appreciate when magic and science come together into one thing, because Let's be real, you can't really have one without the other. I'm probably gonna catch a shit ton of shade for saying that, but I don't care because that's the reality of it. There are scientific reasons for why magic works and magic is a heavy aspect of science. Sanre does such a fucking wonderful job of bringing the science and the magic together. So, we're not just learning grounding. We're not just learning warding or we're not just learning a spell. We're learning the deep inner workings of why these things work, why we do them, why they're important, and how they are doing the thing we need them to do. It's not just blind faith. It's actually a shit ton of evidence for that thing. The reason this is important is because subconsciously, a lot of us kind of struggle to actually believe in our magic. I have dealt with this. I still deal with it sometimes. Where my subconscious mind, because of how logic heavy our society is, tells me this is bullshit. This is just fucking bullshit. And guess what happens when your subconscious mind tells you this is bullshit? It doesn't fucking work. Or it comes out kind of like half-baked. The power level of potential is diminished drastically. The way that Sanre teaches this course, he takes those mechanics and he hands them to your subconscious mind in a wonderful neat package and says, here's your evidence for why it works super fucking powerful. That alone makes it worth it in my eyes. That's not even including the breadth of information that's covered. Everything from Reiki to astrology to what you need to actually cast a spell and have it fucking work, all the way through to how to properly manifest, because let me tell you, the shit that's on the internet about manifesting now is fucking trash. I'm going to probably piss off a lot of people saying that too, but this whole like, think it and it fucking magically happens, not it. Not how manifestation works. Not even close. So you want to learn how to properly manifest? This is your course. 
The other aspects of this course that I personally found really powerful was this course is so incredibly inclusive. Sanre is super mindful of pronouns, is super mindful of things like disadvantages that happen to people of different backgrounds, ethnicities. Um, he's very mindful when it comes to things like cultural appropriation and making sure that's not happening in the space that he's created. And that's something that to me is super fucking important because there's a lot of spaces that aren't like that in the witchcraft world, unfortunately. It just is so refreshing to be in a space that is so inclusive and mindful of those things. This is kind of a very good, happy medium in terms of length, of course. It runs for about a month and it runs every month. So if you are interested in joining Living Witchcraft, you can check it out below. I have the link down there. And I just want to take a moment to say, Sonri, thank you so much for inviting me to join you and the incredible people that I got to share the space with in Living Witchcraft. It was so insightful. I learned so much and it was just a lovely fucking space to be in. And so I'm really grateful that you gave me that opportunity. And so thank you. I appreciate you um, and what you're you're doing in the world. It's fucking needed. So thank you. All right, dear ones, that's what I have for you today. If you do end up joining the course, let me know. I would love to hear about your experience. And Sonri also has a super cool Discord server for everyone who is in Living Witchcraft. I'll be hanging out in there. So please do feel free to come in and say, hey, I would love to see you. And yeah, I appreciate you so much. Thanks for being here. Do something nice for yourself tonight. You deserve it. And until next time, may your path be filled with ease and joy, and I'll see you soon. Bye. <laughs>